We are getting ready to play in the mud. More days of solar shed day 49 yeah day 49 now that our roof is complete the next order of business is to fill in the gaps between the top of our earth bags all the way up to the roof line so that is what we're going to do we're going to actually be testing our cob first because we are not sure if we have enough clay in our soil to be able to use as cob so if we don't we may have to go down to our neighbors and grab some of their clay because they have plenty but we're hoping that it'll work out but today is all about testing it out and seeing if this is actually going to work or not so let's go play in the dirt a total bust. Our soil has way too much sand and not enough clay. You can kind of see on here it's just kind of shifting around when we touch it. So our only option is to go down to our friend's house that has land full of clay, grab a bucket, bring it over, mix it in with our sand mixture, and see if that works better. So off to our friends. Right, I got a bucket full of red sand. I just need to sift it and add it to our previous mix and see if that works.
pretty sure it was a total bust, even with the clay. I think we just don't have enough clay. I, I probably didn't put enough in the mixture. This is all trial and error. I'm going to see how it looks tomorrow after it's had a chance to dry. And then we'll go from there. We'll probably have to either bring a bunch of clay in. I don't know. Have, I don't. I just didn't want to have to pay for the clay. I was really hoping that our soil would work so that this whole building came from our land. But anyway, it is what it is. Our soil probably isn't going to work, but I am going to give it till tomorrow. And I'm going to update this video. I'm going to actually wait and show you what it looks like in the morning before I upload this video. So I don't want to leave you hanging. All right, guys, next day. And this is the test with it was just our soil, so it was really sandy. And it is not sticking very well. Just kind of pull that off and you shouldn't be able to do that. This one had a little bit more of the clay mixture in it. And it's actually staying really well. And even like this part where I really smashed it in better stays really well. So I think we just need to add more clay to our soil. And I think I found a solution for that. And it's very cheap. So we'll be sharing that. But until then, we'll see you tomorrow.